According to a Travis County medical examiner's autopsy report obtained by RadarOnline.com on Monday, the official cause of death of three-time Daytime Emmy Award winner Billy Miller, the young and the restless, General Hospital et al., has been ruled a suicide. The actor, who reportedly struggled with bipolar depression, was found by paramedics inside the bathtub of his Austin, Texas home on Saturday, September 16, and was pronounced dead at the scene. Milda was found deceased with an apparent gunshot wound to the head, the report says, adding, multiple letters indicating suicidal intent and instructions for others were found at the scene. A revolver chamber for 410 shotgun shells was found in the decedent's right hand. Before his death, a toxicology report found that Miller had consumed a cocktail of drugs and medications as demonstrated by the presence of ethanol, cocaine, and its metabolites, diphenhydramine, and amphetamine. Miller's blood alcohol level registered at 0.08, RadarOnline.com reported. The 19-page autopsy report was signed off by Chief Medical Examiner J. Keith Pinkard, M.D., Ph.D. on November 14, 2023. The cause of death statement indicates Miller's cause of death as gunshot wound of head. The manner of death is listed as suicide. Warren William John Miller Sue, the beloved actor died just days shy of his 44th birthday. He fought a long, hard, valiant battle with bipolar depression for years. He did everything he could to control the disease. He loved his family, his friends, and his fans, but in the end, the disease won the fight and he surrendered his life, said Miller's mother, Patricia, in a statement released a few days after her son's passing. In November, the University of Texas at Austin, in conjunction with the Miller family, announced a permanent scholarship endowment that would help radio slash television and film undergraduate students with financial need. We want something positive to be held in his name in perpetuity through the university he loved. His sister Megan Hubble said of the scholarship, he would be honored to know that even in death, he can help someone else realize their dreams. Click here to donate. Miller was one of just 20 students accepted into the University of Texas at Austin's prestigious production sequence program in radio slash television and film. He originally joined the school in the zoology program before switching. UT was reportedly Miller's first choice, even though he had several options presented to him post high school. Miller caught his big acting break in 2007 playing Richie Novak on All My Children. He made his television debut one year earlier appearing in an episode of CSI, NY. Shortly after his departure from the ABC soap in 2008, Miller went on to star as Billy Abbott on The Young and the Restless, where he would receive five Daytime Emmy Award nominations for his portrayal, ultimately taking home three statues, including two for Supporting Actor, 2010, 2013, and one for Lead Actor, 2014. After concluding his time on The Young and the Restless in early 2014, Miller would later join General Hospital, first as Jason Morgan and then as Drew Kane, when it was revealed that Drew was actually Jason's, Steve Burton, twin brother. Following his exit from the soap in 2019, Miller went on to make guest appearances on such shows as Truth Be Told, The Rookie, and NCIS If You or Someone You Know is Contemplating Suicide or Affected by Issues Raised in This Article. Please contact the 988 Suicide and Crisis Lifeline by dialing 988, texting the Crisis Text Line at 988, or going to 988lifeline.org. Two months since the passing of Billy Miller, All My Children, General Hospital, and The Young and the Restless, the late actor's family and friends have set up a permanent scholarship endowment at the University of Texas at Austin to help radio slash television and film undergraduate students with financial need. Born William John Miller Sue, Billy was an avid movie buff, earning his bachelor's degree in radio and television in 2002 at the University of Texas at Austin. He passed away in September, surrendering his life to bipolar depression, which he struggled with his whole life. The three-time Daytime Emmy award-winning actor was just 43 years old. I hope BJ is remembered for the kind-hearted, silly, funny, goofy, generous, beautiful soul that he was, said Miller's sister, Megan Hubble. His metawat smile, deep belly laugh, and gorgeous mutt were gifts on screen, 
but his true self was a bright light that will be carried with us forever. The William John Miller II Billy Miller Memorial Scholarship raises funds in the late actor's honor while paying tribute to his legacy of life and love of acting. He is said to have had a secret passion for acting after beginning a love affair with movies starting in the 1980s, specifically after seeing his first film in theaters, E.T., The Extraterrestrial. Miller, who first made a name for himself in daytime playing Richie Novak on All My Children, went on to receive five Daytime Emmy Award Award nominations for his portrayal of Billy Abbott on The Young and the Restless, ultimately taking home three statues including two for Supporting Actor, 2010, 2013, and one for Lead Actor, 2014. After concluding his time on The Young and the Restless, Miller joined General Hospital in late 2014, first as Jason Morgan and then sometime later as Drew Kane when it was revealed that Drew was actually Jason's twin brother. We want something positive to be held in his name in perpetuity through the university he loved. Hubble said, he would be honored to know that even in death, he can help someone else realize their dreams. Born in Tulsa, Oklahoma and raised in Grand Prairie, Texas, Miller was one of just 20 students accepted into the University of Texas at Austin's prestigious production sequence program in radio slash television and film. He originally joined the school in the zoology program before switching. UT was reportedly Miller's first choice, even though he had several options presented to him post high school. I always admired the guts it took to go after a dream in Hollywood that so many people tried to discourage, Hubble said of her brother's story career which included appearances in such shows as Suits, Ray Donovan, Castle, and NCIS, among others. He heard, you'll never make it more times than I care account, but he used those comments as fuel and said, watch me. In a statement released a few days after his passing, Miller's mother, Patricia Miller, said, I want to personally thank the many fans and personal friends for the overwhelming amount of love prayers and condolences sent to me and my family on the devastating death of my beautiful son BJ, Billy Miller. He fought a long, hard, valiant battle with bipolar depression for years. He did everything he could to control the disease. He loved his family, his friends, and his fans, but in the end, the disease won the fight and he surrendered his life. BJ would want anyone struggling with intrusive thoughts to seek professional help, said Hubble, encouraging people to take stock of their mental health. Do not suffer in silence or try to muscle through on your own. Mental health is vitally important and shouldn't be spoken about in silos behind closed doors, but rather in open forums with open arms. Shame has no place in the discussion to seek help. Click here to donate to the William John Miller II Billy Miller Memorial Scholarship. This scholarship helps radio slash television and film undergraduates in memory of William Billy John Miller II. Donation amounts can be customized and given one time, monthly, or annually. Soap Alum Billy Miller, All My Children, General Hospital, The Young and the Restless will be guest starring in the Monday, October 3 episode of CBS NCIS. He'll be playing the role of Ezra Moretti slash Second Man. In the episode entitled Unearth, a dead body is found at an ancient burial site that is thought to be cursed which leads the NCIS team to determine the motive and the symbolism behind the crime. Also, as NCIS Special Agent Nicholas Nick Torres, Wilmer Valderrama, continues therapy with Dr. Grace Confalone, guest star Laura Sangiacomo, he discovers that their lives are in danger. In addition to Valderrama, the NCIS cast also includes C. Murray as NCIS Special Agent Timothy McGee, Brian Dietzen as Medical Examiner Jimmy Palmer, Diana Reasonover as forensic scientist Casey Hines, Katrina Law as NCIS special agent Jessica Knight, Rocky Carroll as NCIS director Liam Vance, and Gary Cole as FBI special agent Alden Parker. The series airs Mondays at 9 o'clock p.m. ET slash PT on CBS and is available to stream live and on demand on Paramount+. Plus. Since leaving the soap world in 2019, when he last appeared as Drew Kane on GH, Miller made an additional appearance in the final season of USA Network's Suits and appeared in 10 episodes of the Apple TV Plus original series Truth Be Told. He more recently had a guest appearance in an episode of ABC's The Rookie.